Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back once again to Spin Tires. I promise this time it is going to be an actual playthrough. Hopefully. So we will not continue where we last left off. All the settings are on the max. This game isn't too difficult to run. Obviously those of you with much older machines are going to struggle, but I think that's the case with most games nowadays. Uh, anyway. Let's play the game and let's go on Volcano. Why not? Start a new game? Yes. Okay. Let me grab my controller. There we go. Okay. So, what do we have to play with? I think I'm going to jump straight into my... I didn't catch that. I'm going to dive straight into this truck. And let's try... Ooh, we can see the map. Let's cheat. Go down here, down here, down, down. I don't think that's how it runs. Oh well. Excuse me. And let's grab that lumber. Start engine. We've got the medium lug uh, trailer. And let's just go. Now, I watched Kurt J. Mack play this game, and one of his tips, I forgot to say that bugginess, it glitches are back. I'm sorry for that, by the way. But I watch um, his playthroughs on this game, and uh, he mentioned that. Keeping differential lock on is a bad idea. Oof. Ah, damn it. Can we. No, we can't. Damn. Okay. Apparently, keeping the differential lock off saves fuel, and I believe all wheel drive does as well. But. I've never had any problems with fuel in the past. I know I probably jinxed that right now, but I guess we'll find out. That's the fun of the game, really. I don't know where we're going right now, but we're following the red line, and we are on a track, track trial. We're on a trial. That's the word I was looking for. Okay. So for those of you who don't watch my videos, or my other videos, I guess. Uh, I have decided that I'm going to play, and this is a final decision, I've decided I'm going to play three, and try to keep up three games that will be commentated. I'm worried about where to go. This road seems a lot smoother. Yeah. We're playing three commentated games, which will be Jurassic Park Operation Genesis, which I am already playing. Um, Spore, which I've just started playing, I recorded it not five minutes ago, and obviously spent it as. Spore is going to change in the next couple of days when Sims 4 is released, because I really want to play that. Uh, the spin ties will stay until Far Cry 4, or until I finish this game. And Jurassic Park Operation Genesis is just, it's staying. Because I love the game. But yeah. I'm still thinking of a name for my channel. Uh, yeah, I changed it to The Gentleman. I'm not quite sure why. I like the sound of The Gentleman. But I guess we'll find out. Uh, apart from that, I think that's all I really needed to say. Anyway, back to the game. So, I'm really worried that I'm going the wrong way. The red line. The red line of direction. He needs a name. The red line needs a name. Steady now. Have we got seven damage already? Oh, come on. Come on. Ugh. There's rocks everywhere. Up, 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 up. Yes. Okay. It looks like we're doing quite well, actually. Uh, garage is there. So as long as we keep this 
pace up. We should be able to finish the game fairly quickly. And there's rocks. A lot of rocks. So I think the best route, route, some of you, the best route is to go through this water. I hope. Steady. Take it slow. Good. Is that supposed to be rope? I think that's supposed to be rope. I'm not sure. The rope is swinging around like a madman. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I was on the very edge of the cliff there. I'm going to go falling down there. But we are on dry land now, which is always nice. And. <coughs> Excuse me. It should just be around the corner. Why are you up there? Hmm. I'm not quite sure. I think I might be able to cut through there actually. Obviously not when I've got the logs, but it's going to be a big mistake, isn't it? Can I, even, I can't get through that. Okay. You know what? No, we're gonna go around. Going around seems the easiest option. Okay. This is a tight fit. Steady. Come on, you can do this. You can do this. Just take it. I can't see what I'm doing. It's camera angle. Need to keep up momentum, otherwise I'm not gonna make this little hill. Should be out. It's a big truck. Taking a sip of coke while I'm making my way up, as all good lumber drivers do. Where am I going? I'm cutting through what I can. Um, oh, oh, is that? That's a lumber yard there. Yes. Unfortunately, can't. Get through and less and less and less and less and less. We can make it through there. Fifty point turn. Come on. You can make it your big truck. Oh, perfecto. Perfecto. Oh, beautiful. And that's in under 10 minutes. Perfect. Now we just got to get the lumber on. And make our way up that hill, I think. Oh, come on. You can do this, boy. I think I just made a big mistake. Jackknife in the trailer. Okay. Hello, stump. Stumpy the log. That rock is sliding around. They all look the same. Just notice that. How do these rocks just look? Very similar. I think we're making good progress, actually. Um, look at me leaning up forward on my chair. I think that should do it. We just need to line up. Oh. What? What needs to be changed? Oh. Oh, beautiful. Be a beautiful. My voice went now. <coughs> okay, so I think we should start our journey to the objective. 
or not. Or we could stay here. Don't keep wiggling those wheels. Oh, is that what we're stuck on? It's not. Oh, there is. There's a stone right there. Stone? It's not a stone. It's a rock. Okay, let's winch our way out. Nope. No, we won't. I meant to use my chin. Ooh, 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 yes. Go on, you can do this. You're a lumber expert. Oh, no. See, I'm, I'm getting traction on my wheels. It's just, there are two rocks, I believe. Oh my god. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Actually, I think we're going to make it down here and then we're going to leave it at that for this episode. Got to be careful. This is very thin. I don't want to get our wheels jammed. We don't want to tip over either direction. We just got our lugs. I think we're going to leave it here just because I have no idea where to go. I'm going to make it all the way around to the objective, which appears to be that way. So, I think that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching. On the next episode, we will make our way north to the objective, and we'll drop off our first load of lumber, hopefully. See you all next time. See ya.